Michael, you were great in that third period on Sunday versus Texas. You picked it up today as well. Uh, so how's the game feel right now? Uh, it felt good. Uh, yeah, it was one of those games, you know, uh, as a goalie, you know, the first period they kind of shot a bunch of shots through traffic uh, and tried to get a lot of ice in the net, and then the game kind of changed a little bit. And, uh, a lot of their, change, their chances came off of, uh, you know, the rush and, uh, you know, them uh, trying to take the puck to the net. So, uh, yeah, as a goalie, uh, uh, you could definitely see a shift in kind of what they were trying to do, but I thought we did a great job. Uh, uh, we controlled the puck a ton. We didn't force too many things. Uh, you know, the other team can't score when you hold the point of the puck for well over half the game. So I thought we did a good job, uh, yeah, controlling the puck and being patient and waiting for our opportunities tonight. Your reaction to uh, the news of Keith being promoted to head coach of the Leafs? Uh, I'm really excited for Sean. You know, he's he's an amazing coach. Uh, you know, I've only had him for a little bit uh, here, but you know, seeing his preparation every day and uh, you know his attention to detail and the way he sees the game is uh, very different than uh, you know anything I've been around before. So uh, you know, I'm super excited for him to have this opportunity. I know he's going to do an amazing job. Having played at uh, both this level and with the Leafs, how would you compare the? The ways that Coach Keefe and Coach Babcock approach the game. Uh, yeah, like I said, it's it's hard to say because I've only had a small sample size with both right. guys. So, uh, but you know, I think that you know the way Sheldon's coaching here, I positive it's going to translate uh, to success up in the NHL level. Uh, you know, he, he sees the game. Uh, you know, like I said, he sees the game a little bit differently than uh, most coaches, and it's in a way where every single day you come to the rink, I, I come to the rink, and I learn something new uh, just listening to him. So uh, it's exciting, uh, and like I said, I'm excited for another opportunity. Mentally for you, what has this season been like being up with the Leafs and now being back here? It's been tough. Uh, yeah, uh, you know, uh, it's one of those things where, you know, like I said uh, before, you know, take it one day at a time and you just keep moving forward so uh yeah that's all i'm trying to do right now you know i'm here uh you know i'm trying to help the team win uh you know we have a fun group of guys in here we have a good team uh so you know it, it's fun being down here you know it's not like uh you know a lot of situations uh with other teams you know where there's uh you have to change cities and stuff when you get sent down so uh that's definitely been a positive uh you know being able to stay in the same spot and uh being comfortable with uh you know the coaches the training staff and everyone here so uh uh yeah, it's been uh, difficult, but, you know, I'm just trying to keep moving forward. I know it's a small sample size, but what was Babcock like? I'm not asking you to spit on the grave here. Just, like, what uh, was he, how did he, he treat you? How did he treat others? He, he, he was always great to me and my family, so, uh, you know, I don't have anything bad to say about him. Uh, you know, you never wish uh, anyone to get fired. Uh, you know, if you do, I think you have some bigger problems than uh, that. So, uh, yeah, you know, it's one of those things where, you know, it's unfortunate for him, but uh, like I said, you know, like, Sheldon's done so much for uh, the organization here, and uh, I'm excited for him to have an opportunity.